Welcome to Java Forum. Now we are going to see how to install and configure OpenSUSE 15.2 Leap Edition on VMware Workstation 16. So first I am going to create one new virtual machine choosing a typical configuration. So installer disk image, I'm going to select OpenSUSE 15.2, which I already downloaded from OpenSUSE website. So you can see that OpenSUSE is detected. I'll install this operation later. So from dropdown, I am selecting OpenSUSE 64-bit. So click the next button. So now I'm going to give one name, virtual machine, virtual machine name. Next button. Next, I am going to allocate some hard disk space and store it in a single file. Next, I am going to customize the hardware. So, I am going to increase the physical memory. So, 8 GB RAM I am allocating. Next, processor core I am allocating is 4 CPU cores. And this uh, virtualization engine parameters are optional. Next, for CD and DVD, once again I am uh, browsing the open to see 15.2. DVD ISO file. Next network network adapter will be NAT so that it can be connected to the internet. So finish. You can see that uh, open to C15.2 virtual machine is created and these are the configurations. So let me start the installation now. So during the startup, VMware may ask for a software update like uh, VMware tools for Linux uh, installation. So Please download and install it so that it will avoid uh, lots of uh, guest edition problem. Make sure that you are connected to the internet throughout the installation. So installation is uh, yet to be start now. So this open to see 15.2 installation will take uh, lot of time depends upon the speed of your computer so it it will initialize the installer it will connect to the online repositories so press yes to activate the online repositories it will be very very useful so I think using around uh, four uh, repositories. Then system role, select uh, the desktop with genome. I'm going to select uh, desktop with genome. So left side you can see the check, sorry, uh, radio button. I am selecting desktop with genome. Click the next button. So suggested partitioning, it will be guided setup. So all the partition will be installed in a single drive so now I am checking I'm uh, sorry now I'm selecting the time zone so it's my location click the next button now I'm going to create one uh, login username and going to provide password to that uh, login user Click the next button. Next, I am going to create 
the root user and also providing the password to the root user. So these are the installation settings for uh, OpenSUSE 15.2. Make sure that you are connected to the internet. So I'm going to enable uh, SSH server also. So SSH server is very, very important uh, tool. Secure shell access I'm going to enable and I'm going to enable SSH port also. So these are optional things. If you want, you can enable it later. So click the install button. Yes, so installation is uh, started. You can see that lots of packages are uh, getting downloaded and updated. So this will take some time. So installation is uh, done. I am rebooting open to see 15.2. So I have successfully, successfully rebooted and I have logged in. So you can see that uh, display is adjusted automatically. Resolution is got adjusted automatically according my, to my monitor resolution. Next, I am going to open the terminal. I am going to check whether uh, VMware tools installed or not. VMware, press tab key, yes. You can see these are the commands available. So VMware tools is installed successfully and this is the version for open to see VMware tools version for open to see. So now I have typed some command. I'm going to copy paste this terminal output to windows host machine. So I'm going to check shared clipboard feature that is copy paste functionality. I'm going to copy it. Yes, so I have pasted the content uh, successfully. So copy paste feature is working fine between uh, open to see 15.2 virtual machine and Windows host. Now I am typing some text in Windows host and I am going to paste to open to see 15.2 VM. Yes, successful. So both to VM to host and host to VM are working fine. So copy paste shared clipboard feature is working fine. Now I am going to check the drag and drop feature. I am going to drag and drop one file from uh, Windows host to open to see 15.2 VM. So let me drag and drop one file. Yes, I can able to drag and drop one file. So you can see that uh, file is getting copied. One second, I'm trying. Yes. So drag and drop feature also working fine. So open to see 15.2 installation on VMware Workstation 16 is successful. Make sure that you are connected to the internet so that uh, automatically this uh, VMware tools will be getting installed. No need of manual work. So uh, all done automatically and you can see that uh, share clipboard and drag and drop are working for me.